What is going on everybody? My name is Robert Watkin and welcome back to another video on the channel. So I got a question the other day on how to download videos off Instagram to a desktop. Um, so one of my previous tutorials I showed how to download Instagram videos onto an Android phone. And now I'm going to show you how to get those videos onto your desktop so you can use them, edit them, do whatever you want with them. Now the way I do this is actually my own way. Um, I had to mess around to discover this a little while ago when I was trying to make little Instagram compilations for my other YouTube channel so I'm going to show you how to do it, it is a little bit complicated, I don't know if there is a better way personally but this is the way I do it and it does work um, so yeah you'll get to see that now. So here I'm on the Motors Projects Instagram page, they're a free running Instagram page as you can see they've got some cool free running videos and stuff here, we'll just click on one of these, uh, I think I watched this one the other day and this kid is absolutely sick. Woo! So you can see this kid's just doing some absolutely insane moves. Um, so yeah, let's say we wanted to download this video for whatever reason. The way I'd start by doing this is if you are on Google Chrome, you can right click on the video and click inspect. And this will basically bring up the background code for the Instagram video or for the page. Um, it'll do it for any page you're on, but in particular we're doing it for Instagram. Um, also make sure you've got your video in full view and you've got Instagram in your web browser. That's quite an important step um, but yeah we've got the video here you've right clicked inspect and then you can see here it selects it here you can see that whenever you hover over anything in the code it'll actually highlight it on the left hand side um, also this panel may be at the bottom for some of you um, if it is it doesn't make a difference as long as you can see this section of code that is all you need if you know anything about code, this will probably be a little bit easier for you. If you've used HTML before, this will be a bit easier. If not, just follow along. So you can see here, once you have selected the actual video, you've inspected it, you can see that there is a few links which when you hover over it, it highlights the actual video. You'll see two div classes or two div tags and then you'll see an A tag. You want to click on this first div tag here. You'll get this big chunk of code here, um, it's a video tag and you can see that there's actually a link inside of here. If you look just where it says source here, you can see it says https colon slash slash and then it's got just a bunch of uh, text, 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 text and then it ends in .mp4. Now what you want to do, you want to double click on this section, it should automatically select the link. You then just want to copy that by using control C on your keyboard or you can just right click and click copy. You then want to open a new tab and then click Control V, hit enter, and then this is going to exclusively open up that video in a new tab. And then to download the video, you can simply right click on the video, click save video as, and then you can save it where you want. I'm going to go desktop here and I'm just going to name it Parkour Cool Kid. It's a sick name. And then we can see it's saved there. If we click on this video now, it will open up and we have got the video downloaded. Now, one thing I'm going to say is be careful what you are downloading off Instagram simply because um, it's it's not a worry about viruses or anything like that. It's a worry that this content does belong to other people. Make sure you've got proper permissions to use the content from other people because if you don't, they could end up like trying to get a copyright strike on you. It could backlash. Um, but yeah, just be careful with what you're downloading. Um, but that is how to get it on your desktop for whatever reason. Personally, when I've done this in the past, I've used it for my own videos. I've made a uh, little Instagram free running compilations out of the videos I have on my Instagram. Um, so yeah, that's what I've been using it for. And of course, I'm not going to try and copyright strike myself. So I would recommend if you if you're doing it. Hopefully you're only doing it for something that is your content. If it is someone else's content, make sure you have proper permission to use the content first um, and don't just be downloading it without their permission. I'm a bit hypocritical there considering I've just done this without permission. Lol. Uh, <laughs> also another thing you can do is if you are using other people's content, at least give them the proper credit. Um, so that's what I'm going to do here. If you would like to check out Motors Projects, if you're into free running, go check out their account on Instagram. It's pretty cool. They've also got a YouTube channel where they do some pretty sick videos and stuff. Um, so yeah, that's the video I got this little clip from. But that is going to be it for this tutorial, guys. Thanks for watching. I hope you'd enjoy. I hope it helped. Remember, if it did help, please subscribe if you want to see more and uh, leave a like down below. Also, comment any other tutorials you would like to see on the channel. I am happy to do them. And that is going to be it for this video, guys. So I'll see you in the next one of whatever I make.